How's it going guys, Cracked Rack here, and since over the last two weeks I've made two whole videos on fat people that I despise, I thought I'd add to the holy trinity of calories by talking today about the myth, the legend, the donut annihilator, Amberlynn Reed. Now you may or may not know this about me, but I love lolcow farms and websites like it. A lot of people hate that website and swear you're the devil if you use it, but oh my god, it is paradise on earth for people like me who just want to laugh at insane people. It's essentially a website where a bunch of people find these weird, narcissistic internet creators who have no self-awareness and essentially just make fun of them. Now, I don't partake in actually utilizing the website, I don't comment there, I do think people get a little carried away there, and some people are just straight stalkers, but I do genuinely enjoy browsing it. And one of the most massive, no pun intended, subjects of that website other than Onision himself is a character that goes by the name Amberlynn Reed. This is a essentially a woman who's been making YouTube videos for over eight years now and has become a global superstar just for being a giant fat ass. And I'm not joking when I say this woman is a global fucking superstar. Her YouTube channel has over 100 million total channel views. That is more views than some musical superstars get in their entire fucking careers. And this woman has gotten it by shoving nine Big Macs in her mouth at once on camera like every day for eight years. Though, to be fair, her fan base is not an actual fan base. No one's watching this girl and her stupid mukbangs because they think her personality is funny. They're watching it to watch the freak show. Hell, her fan base doesn't even refer to her as a girl, they refer to her as a goral instead, which I find telling of how they feel about her as a human being. Honestly, her name has been dragged through the mud so much in the last year, people might as well start referring to her as a goddamn ogre. Anyway, when I first discovered Amberlynn on the lolcow farms, I wasn't gonna make a video on her because I figured she was just some mentally ill fat person that couldn't help her issue, like 30% of the poor sap on lolcow. However, after doing some pretty heavy research, I found that, holy shit, that is not the case at all. The reason people hate Amberlynn Reed is because she apparently starts these diets or announces she's going to be starting a diet, and then instantly within a few days makes a video where she's like, alright guys, time to eat this entire pepperoni pizza with a cheese-filled crust and a large soda. It's just absolutely absurd, and it's one of the most entertaining things I've ever seen. Also, honestly, if there's one thing I hate more than anything, it's fat people trying to make excuses for their behavior. I also despise seeing fat people who look like their heart is about to flatline any second shove thousands of empty calories down their gullets. Oh yeah, and there's another reason I fucking hate Amberlynn Reed. In every single video she makes where she's gobbling down pizza like the world is going to end, she eats like a fucking pig. Like she actually chews food with the same exact mouth patterns as a pig enjoying its trough. It's absolutely disgusting and infuriating. And the sound it makes when she eats, it's like... I have never been infuriated by someone eating before, but Amberlynn Reed has somehow made that a new issue for me because she's just that gross. Now the ultimate trinity of reasons to hate Amber aren't just because of her eating habits, it's because she blames everybody and everything else for her fatness, and she has a gigantic ego, and actually thinks she's pretty. So all three of those things combined make a pretty fucking abysmal human being who absolutely nobody wants to be around. So yeah, if you've been hearing the name Amberlynn Reed get thrown around quite a bit and have no clue what it means, that's a general explanation. She's just an entitled, arrogant, mentally ill, obese person who refuses to change and actually enjoys live-streaming her own death because she's so stubborn and awful she thinks it's funny to make people watch her eat herself to death. I should also mention Amber treats animals, her family, friends, and even viewers all like shit. She's just all around a garbage human being, inside and out, and that's why I really don't feel bad making fun of her this hard. When it comes to someone like Chris Chan, I do feel bad making fun of someone like that, because they genuinely can't help how absolutely childlike and stupid they are. But Amberlynn is fully aware of what she is doing and definitely knows better than to do half of the stuff she regularly does. Now, am I saying I want her to die? No. But would I feel bad if she did? No, not really. I just don't feel bad for people like this. They refuse help, they make themselves worse, and they harm other people because of their own problems. In my opinion, that is an absolutely worthless person that deserves no sympathy at all for any reason. 
You know, with all these awful people I talk shit about on my channel, I'm starting to feel like motherfucking Gandhi in comparison. What is it about the internet that attracts people like this? It would never be a thing in the 90s or super early 2000s to make someone famous just for the sole purpose of shitting in their mouth. And like I said, Amberlynn Reed is famous. I guarantee you, through the sheer power of being a giant fat ass with cellulite on every single pore of her body, she gets recognized on the street all the time. Anyway, that's all for today's video. I just wanted to share this absolute beauty with you all. Some things are just too beautiful not to talk about. See ya.